Just look at life better than the life I lived when I thought that I was gonna go crazy. Y'all already know what it is, we in a new crib, y'all know what it is, we in a new crib, y'all know what it is, we in a new crib. Dash's new kingdom, Dash's new safe haven, Dash Kaiser Porter's home. Like, this is my home. Y'all hearing me? This is my home. This is my home. Only me, no one else. Like, what the fuck? Yo, this is fucking insane. Oh my god. Go! Yo, let's fucking get it. I don't even know what to do with myself. I'm actually texting my mom, and I know I should take a break. And she's like, yo, chill. You just moved everything from one side of New York to the whole other side. Like, take a putting things up a little later. I'm over here like, nah, I want to get straight to it. Like, I need to see my crib in full fucking effect, yo. I need to see my crib in full fucking effect. So we about to get right into it. Obviously, I won't get every single thing done today, but I'm going to get a lot out the way as much as possible. I made sure to take a lot of time off this week so I can be home and like just settle in. Duh, that's most important. If I'm not good in the head, if I'm not good in the heart, if I'm not good in my home, there is no way I'm gonna be good enough to face the outside world. And hold on, that's so nice. That is so nice. It's funny, cause me and my mom over here texting, talking about like, yo, I got some good ass lighting. Like we about to get shifty in this bitch, yo. My plants are gonna love it. My art is gonna love it. I'm gonna love it. And I'm already loving it. As y'all can see, I am hype. I am lit as fuck. I don't even know what to do. I should probably get off this table, get my shit together. Anyway, I want y'all to keep this beautiful ass sunset. I can't fully see it because this side of my building is blocking it, but I can see the sky and it looks pretty and I like how it's reflecting off that building. So I'm gonna show y'all real quick. All right. All right, here's the view. Y'all can't tell me that ain't sexy. The train itself is real close to my crib. Like I'm thankful. I don't gotta walk too far. The bank is right around the corner. There's like three supermarkets. Got a 99 cent store. You actually got to strip the shop right along there. We got a new library coming, a hospital down the block. The beach is like 10, 15 minutes from my crib. So we got a lot of good things going in the area. We also got a YMCA down the block. Long Island is literally like 10 minutes on that side. Talking about we in Queens. We ain't fucking in Queens. We in Long Island. I don't care what y'all say. We got a lot of good stuff in the area, and I'm definitely going to take time to explore the neighborhood. Probably take you on a little trip with me, or on a couple of trips with me. The only thing that sucks is to get to the city on the train, it's already an hour. To get into, like, downtown Brooklyn, Brooklyn Bridge Park and all of that, that's an hour, bro. To get to, like... <laughs> It's fucking ridiculous, and I'm in Queens. I'm in Queens. I'm far as fuck. It's called Far Rockaway for a reason. I get it, but we not. It's no reason to call it Far Rockaway and then attach it to Queens. Like it, Far Rockaway is Far Rock. Like it's just his own spot in New York. Like. <gasps> ah! <laughs> that just made my whole fucking day, yo. I didn't. I. Okay, blah, 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 blah. let me gather my thoughts. I knew that if I walk to certain parts, or like if I go to a train station, or definitely when I'm on a train, definitely when I'm on a highway, and definitely when I'm on a beach, I would be able to see airplanes take off. But I literally just seen an airplane take the fuck off, bro. That is sick as fuck. I see that from my window. Y'all probably can't see it, but it's flying away over there. Yo, that is sick. Wow, and actually I can see the lights for the airport now that I'm really looking. That is fucking sick. If you know me, you know I fucking love airplanes, bro. And I will sit at the airplane and just watch airplanes take off. So to be able to see that from my crib is dope as fuck. It's not a crystal clear view, obviously. It's like mad fucking far away, but I can still see the airplane take off. Like, thank you. Like, ah, I'm so happy. And then as the sun goes down, sunset, the skyline, just watching the colors come in and out is so beautiful. Bro, like, oh. I'm blessed, man. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank everyone. Thank you. We did that shit. The following day. Yo, good morning, good afternoon. It's most definitely like 12 in the afternoon right now. I definitely woke up on the later side. I was up 
pretty late last night trying to get the apartment together as y'all can see today we're just going to continue to get shit together and see where we end up damn i didn't show y'all shit from last night of what i did all right all right all right all right so my phone ended up dying it was dead for like 30 minutes so i had to go outside i had to find a store i stopped at the bank while i was there i stopped at the 99 cent store while i was there i actually stopped at three 99 cent stores because it was all right next door to each other honestly i don't get there's literally a strip down the block right on this one singular block this one singular shopping block which has mad fucking stores on both sides not even gonna hold y'all peep this though it has four nail salons two barber shops and 399 cent stores on the same block the 99 cent stores there are two right like right next door to each other the third one is one door over the barber shops both on the same side of the block right both on the on the right side one is at one corner the other one's at the other corner then we have i said four nail salons right four nail salons you have one on the left side three on the right side of the street and two are next door to each other and they're all different companies different names it's not like they're they're like the same company with two different storefronts next to each other no these all are completely different companies different on it the craziest thing is the barbershops both had business Every nail salon, all four of them had business, had people coming in and out of. There were two that were more popular. One is Cindy's, and then the other one has this yellow awning on it. So know that if I ever want to get my nails done, or, you know, friends come through, shorty come through, they want to get their nails done, I know exactly where to take you. For a quick bite last night, I went to the fucking fried chicken spot on the corner, literally on the corner of my block. It's like any other fucking fried chicken spot in New York City. It's, it's, I, you know. Honestly, it's just so nice watching all the airplanes take off. <laughs> Some of them actually have a flight route directly over my building, so it'll come from the airport. It's just so fucking cool to watch. Um, most of them do go that way. Um, but ultimate look, there's one fucking ticket. Hold on, hold on, hold on. There's... See, look, 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 it's coming from literally right there. Look, 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 look. <laughs> I will say again, I'm not gonna let this shit go. I live in Long Island. I don't care what anyone says. I live in Long Island, bro. There's no way the New York City MTA bus and the Long Island nice bus are running on the same blocks, bro. You're not gonna tell me I don't live in Long Island? Come on now, bro. I'm telling you. If I walk 10 minutes down the block, I'm in Long Island. If I drive like three minutes down the block, I'm in Long Island, so... I don't know, guys. Literally, I can look up at night and see the fucking stars, bro. I can see the stars at night, bro. There's no, like, fucking light pollution nearby. That's... <sighs> bro, I, I can see airplanes taking off from my crib. I can look up at night and see the fucking stars. I'm, like, 10, 15 minutes away from the beach, bro. Like, I got my own private crib. There's no one in here with me. Y'all hear me? Screaming! Y'all hear me? You hear me? You hear me loud and clear? Because it's all me. Just me, big, big, just me. <laughs> I worked my ass off for this, so... Yeah, I deserve this. I deserve this. Anyway. This morning, I made sure to turn my electricity on. Well, it was already on, but I made sure to put in my name. Um, I also called Verizon instead of my Wi-Fi, and they will be coming Friday morning to do all that. Um, even though it is Monday morning, um, I'm just gonna have to wait all the way until Friday to get proper Wi-Fi. Um, but enough chatting. <laughs> Two very boring minutes later. I love you, Dash Cards of Polo. I'm over here supposed to be getting a bathroom together. I'm over here posting old TikToks, clearing out the draft, and falling in love with myself in the mirror. Like, come on now, come on. You see how beautiful your boy look? You are beautiful in every single way. Words can't bring you down, but they can lift me up. I'm beautiful. Let's fucking go to the top. Let's go. Hey, 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 ho. Let's fucking go. Five minutes later. I'm so I'm some real cocky shit. I'm the best thing for you, bitch. <laughs> Yo, I look so fucking good.
Who am I yelling at? Like, I'll be close. Look at me on the wheel or something. Like I said, when I get a chance, I'm gonna fuck you like an owner. They'll come from my brain, they'll get on me. No matter what you say, what you do, what happened to my brother, what you do? What you do, you got me right beside, 2005, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I'm like a fucking avatar. I should be in the museum. Y'all should praise me. 15 minutes later. Um, so I'm working on the bathroom. Well, I'm not really working on the bathroom. I'm standing in the bathroom. I'm admiring how gorgeous myself is. The camera over there recording me. And I was just standing here, um, going through my old TikTok videos. Anyway, hey, I forgot to tell y'all that I actually got my first fucking package here yesterday. The same day I moved in, the same day I got my first package here. You know, that's fucking crazy. I'm actually gonna have a whole unboxing video for that. I bought mad shit from Amazon. Also, have a boohoo manhole coming in. I'm gonna do a whole separate fucking video for that. My first package is here. I'm over here talking. I should probably show y'all the, the package, right? What was so amazing about receiving this package... First of all, not only have a nice ass mailbox, little lobby set up downstairs, they could have just left it down there. But these niggas brought this shit to my door. What? It's, we moving up in life, baby, because you, you leaving packages at my door. I don't even have to worry about niggas stealing my packages. We living real good. I went in the hallway to throw my garbage in the incinerator. I went outside. I, I, I opened my door. I looked down and I said, wow. Is this for me? I looked at the name. I didn't, I'm lying. I didn't even look at the name. I picked the box up and walked right back in my crib. That garbage had to wait a second because I said, Ah, my package really came. A lot of boring math later. We got, we got here this shit at full fucking value. I should bring my speaker to this bitch. I've heard this song in months. I'm gonna fuck about none of that shit. About none of that shit. I'm gonna fuck about none of that shit. Okay, anyway, back to the regularly scheduled programming. I just had to I had to let that out real quick. I don't know. The song came to mind and we had to put on a little show, so I had to do what needed to be done and I did that. What actually should go in the medicine cabinet versus what should I don't know. I ain't never did this before. But this is my own job, so we about to make this shit up, right? Right. I just don't... <laughs> Honestly, I just don't know how to set this up, so I'm trying to work my way through it right now, so... Sorry if I look a little crazy. Yeah, it's just a dusty ass hell, I'm telling you. I can take my in the fucking room. I mean, that's what I really need to be taking too. Yeah, yeah. My iron levels are ass, but it thanks to me starting tea, my iron went up just a tad bit, but still not enough. So me not taking my iron pills is really fucking bad actually. So I need to get on a rapid release versus eight hour. We don't want the rapid release. I don't like to take those, but if I do, I want that shit to work as fast as possible because that means I'm at, I'm past my time. So like, I really don't feel what I'm going through, and I don't mean that in a way that I'm trying to, you know, I'm. I mean, I'm taking pills only when I'm in extreme pain. If there's no reason to take a pill, I'm not taking a pill. I don't know. I'd rather not have to take it in the first place. Here I am, once again, feeling lost, but now and then, I'm breathing in, so let it go, go. And you don't know what you want now, you're lost in the moment. If only somebody could hear, well, you figured out how you lost in the moment you disappear. You don't have to be afraid to put your dreams in action. You're never gonna fit, you get a main attraction. Not trying to say, just another day when it turns all right. If you know something in your imagination, tomorrow you'll be everybody's fascination. Just remember, man. Just remember, man. When I make it shine. Leave it all to me. Leave it all to me, just leave it all to me. What show did y'all think was better, Victorious or iCarly? Damn, that's a really good toss-up. I feel like younger teenage me connected more with iCarly, but older teenage me connected more with Victorious. I enjoyed both shows very well. I think I can remember more iCarly shows than Victorious, but both big. Both have good ass fucking soundtracks. I think Victorious soundtrack is better though. Hell oh, yeah. Nah, Victorious soundtrack banks. Like, you could put that shit on right now and I'll, I'll rock out to it. No cap. God damn, I really have to wait until Friday for these people to come install the Wi Fi. Like, this shit is so slow without Wi Fi, bro. Just so slow. So slow. Go low. Hey, low, then you know I go low. Go low.
Ooh, I just got another package. This is what Amazon folded up, so we got away. Looking at this, and even like this, you know, a cool fact I recently learned that's all glass is actually green. It just takes a certain amount for you to actually physically be able to see it with your eyes. And then on top of that, all water is blue. It just takes a certain amount for us to physically see it with our eyes. And just like water can be blue, once it's dirty or not pure, clean water, it will appear green. Life lessons with dash kinds of water. Yep, yep, da. So for now, I want to say that part is done. Three days later. What's good? What's good, my beautiful peoples? I'm just over in the kitchen making me a little concoction. Which comprises of rum, coconut mix, and pineapple juice and junk. Y'all already know what it is. It's a pina colada, your boy's favorite drink in the world. But I decided to spice it up just a little. Don't ask me why, but I put my protein mix in there. Not too much because, one, why the fuck am I doing it in the first place? And two, <laughs> the protein mix itself has... An acquired taste, so I didn't want to fuck up my drink. But well, we're going to try that out. I'm going to let y'all know how that go. It is officially Friday, March 3rd. I got my Wi-Fi set up this morning. Thank the fucking Lord Jesus, because my hot spot, as much as it was a blessing, it was just draining me. Oh, my God. And I could not do any type of editing this whole week. But it's all right. We back in business, guys. So, so y'all already know that means I'm going to have a new video for y'all coming real soon, right? Right. Anyway, let me show y'all what I've done. But also, let's let's try this drink real quick, all right? Let's try this drink. All right, here we go. This is the taste test of the century. We're gonna, we gonna try it. Y'all ready? I put a lot of fucking rum in here. <laughs> I'm not even a drinker. I'll smoke my life away, but drinking... I leave that for y'all alcoholics over there. Just look at life better than the life I live when I thought that I was gonna go crazy. And then my grandmama ain't the only one that's calling me baby. And if you're feeling me now, put your hands up in the sky and let me hear you say, hey, 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 I'm good. Mm. Shorty thicker than a snicker, but it tastes real good. Mmm, hmm. -hmm. I did that. Your boy keep coming with the bangers, man. I did that. I will say, again, the protein shit, a quiet taste, throws it off just a, just a little bit. But overall, I'm about to be lit in this bitch. I'm not finna hold y'all. Oh my god, this is amazing. I guarantee you, my, my neighbors be looking over like, what the fuck is wrong with this black kid? <laughs> Nothing, baby. I am living my best fucking life over here. Y'all see me? Or do I need to make the picture a little clearer? A little clearer now. Yeah, I can't wait to start having people over. And I'll start cooking and making drinks for them. It's going to be a fucking time to be alive and pop out at my crib, bro. I'm telling you, I'm telling you. History will be made in this fucking apartment. Mad bitches. Mad bitches. Mad bitches. As y'all can see, I still need a shower curtain. None of the 99 cent stores or pharmacies in the area had any good ones, so I was not about to waste no time or money. But I'll get one real soon. And obviously, I want to buy other things to jazz up the bathroom. But that will happen over time. No need to rush it. I've only been here, what, four or five days. So I could calm down a little. My main goal is just to get comfortable, get rid of the boxes and the bags, and to clean up the floor. And I did that. Okay, okay. As you can see, I done basically put everything away. You know, I had to hook my little area up, obviously. It's not done yet, but we got the two monitors. We got the laptop. We got everything we need. Cameras, mainly camera stuff, everyday needs, work-related stuff. And we got a little, little cute collage on the side going on over here. And I want to finish decorating the rest of the walls, but again, that will happen in due time as well. And again, there's a whole bunch of stuff I need to do still, but it will happen in due time. There is no need to rush. This is my home now, and I'll be here for a while, so I might as well get comfortable and relax, you know? But 
I'm excited. I'm extremely thankful to be here. I don't know how many times I'm gonna keep saying that, but I'll, I'll say it until I die. Like, thank you, thank you, thank you. And yeah, honestly, that's all that needs to be said on my end. Like, and y'all done took this little journey with me and, and thank y'all for taking it with me. Having y'all alongside with me really just made the journey a little bit easier and fun, you know? So thank y'all for taking this little trip with me. And yeah, I'll see y'all in the next video. I, I got more stuff coming through. We in a new place. We in a new environment. We in a new home. Might as well explore. Spring is right around the corner. So about to have mad fucking content coming for y'all. And also I got other surprises. Prizes I want to share with y'all. Life is beautiful. Life is great. I'm so blessed to be here. Hope you feel the same way too. And if no one told you, I fucking love you. Enjoy. Have a good night. 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 Or have a good day, depending on when you're seeing this. Oh, also, like, comment, subscribe. I, I don't be really saying that because I don't really care. You know, if you do, you do. If you don't, you don't. But, you know, I always appreciate it if you do.